Hi everyone, I'm Lisa O'Neill from Growing Your Baby and today we're taking a look at the Bugaboo Runner. So Bugaboo has a completely full collection. They've got a travel stroller, they have a double, they've got an urban stroller, and they also have an all-terrain. And now they have a jogger. But what's nice for fans of the brand, if you already have one of their strollers, you could use the seat from the Buffalo, the Chameleon 3, the, the B3, and also the donkey on this frame. So this frame retails for $400, or you could buy the whole package and it goes for about 800 with the seat and the frame. So we have the runner seat that we're gonna be using with the frame today. If you just purchase the stroller, you can just get adapters that will allow you to use your existing seat on the frame, which is awesome. So as you can see, the frame here is very compact. So to open it, all you do is just drop that down and push this out. So the frame on its own weighs just under 20 pounds. And then when you add the seat and all of the other accessories, you're sitting at probably close to 28 pounds for the, for the whole stroller, which isn't bad for a, for a really good jogger. So these are the adapters. They just snap on here. And then the seat can be, can be positioned facing out or just with the flip of the switch here. You can turn it around for facing you. So in the facing you configuration, You can see there's a really, really great recline there. Now this stroller is only designed for kids that are nine months up to just under 40 pounds. So you can't use this frame with an infant seat or a bassinet. So the runner comes with Bugaboo's Comfort Seat five point adjustable harness. And I love this harness because it's structured. So it fits perfectly over their shoulders and really, really nicely around their waist. So how it connects is all four pieces basically just feed right into the hub here. Parents can adjust the width on each side and then there's two height positions here and you can just adjust this up and down to fit the right height for your child. The seat also has a footrest and then Bugaboo includes the bumper bar. and it is pivotable if you just want to keep it in. The canopy on this stroller is awesome. So the standard canopy, as you can see, is just a standard two panel canopy, but Bugaboo has added a zip out that allows it to extend right over top of your child. So this is really, really nice if you want to jog in the middle of the summer or even if you get caught in the rain because this pretty much covers your child all the way down to their knees. So the runner rides on three air-filled tires. At the front here we've got a fixed 14-inch wheel and then at the back we've got two 16-inch tires. This combination gives the stroller a gorgeous push. I really really like this stroller We've been using it on the trails out behind our house and it does very, very well on uneven pavement, gravel, taller grass, through a bit of mud. And we've also tested it through some of the softer sand and it's done really, really well. I actually prefer jogging with this stroller on the gravel and in, in the softer sand because when you're going around the corner, it's a little bit more giving. When you've got the fixed front wheel, the stroller doesn't turn as nicely as a regular urban stroller because it doesn't have that flexibility because the, the wheel is locked in the front position. I like using it on the gravel because when you go around the corner, it's able to give a little bit better and I find the maneuverability to be a little better with it. On the handle here, Bugaboo has installed a brake and that controls the front wheel there. And then at the back here, there is a, a back wheel brake. The one that's very similar to most of the strollers that Bugaboo has. 
At the back here, we also have two fenders to prevent the mud from flying up all over the place. And then we've also got the storage basket as well. So this storage basket's great. It's not massive, but when you're out jogging, you're not gonna take a ton of stuff with you. What this has though, is it has two elastic loops here. So what it does is it'll hold your stuff in. So if you wanna bring a sweater, you wanna bring a backpack, this will kind of secure that in there so it doesn't fly out if you're going over some uneven or bumpy terrain. There's also a small loop at the front for a water bottle. And then we've got three storage pockets back here that are Velcroed shut if you wanna add, put your keys, your phone, or maybe a little bit of money. On the handle here, we've got the strap to prevent the stroller from rolling away from you. And then on the sides here, these are the levers that you use to fold the stroller. So the fold on this stroller is very, very easy. All you have to do is take the seat off I take these off as well. And then all you do is pull this up, push this forward, and then just grab this bar and you'll hear it click in place. There isn't a frame lock for this, but it actually does a really good job of staying closed. So just kind of grab it and prop it up. So there you have it. This is the Bugaboo Runner. We have really loved testing this because it really is a great stroller to run with. We took it on the sidewalks, we took it on the trails, in some of the deeper, softer sand to see how it would do on the beach. We're not close to a beach, so I couldn't actually take it onto the softer, finer sand, but it did a really good job over most terrains. So if you're an active parent and you're looking for a stroller that'll keep up with you on the trails or at the park, the Bugaboo Runner is a really, really great option. Thank you so much for joining me and please subscribe to our channel for more great videos.